Hey everybody, this is Coach Jen. As you know, we're continuing with our Finish Strong 2019 series of posts. Tonight, the part of the modern veterinarian that we want to talk about is the evening routine and the things that you're doing to set yourself up for a good night of recovery and sort of regaining and recharging for that next day. Specifically, we want you to think about the place that you're sleeping. Think about your bedroom. What are the things that you're doing in your bedroom? Are you watching TV? Are you Netflix? Are you on your phone the whole time? Maybe sleeping, maybe eating, maybe studying. Could be any number of things. The modern veterinarian knows the bedroom is for two things, sleep and not sleep. Wink, wink, right? Uh, so you guys know what I'm talking about. I don't need to spell it out, you're smart people. Ryan and I want you to think about and know that there's a lot of value in being very respectful of the space that you're in. You know, thinking about your kitchen and your dining room is the place where you're gonna eat. Thinking about your bedroom is the place where you're gonna have restful sleep and recovery. And it's for sleep and the not sleep, if you will. So don't be spending all your time on your phone. Don't be constantly voided away on your computer, your tablet, um, or on TV. You need to actually have a little space to de decompress and disconnect from those pieces of equipment. And what better way than to potentially spend a little time with your partner. So think about what you're doing, how you're setting yourself up for recovery, how you're actually spending some time with the people that are important to you. And specifically tonight, when it comes to your evening routine, I want you to think about the things that you're using your bedroom for. We want you to carry on and keep finishing strong in 2019. We want you to kick off 2020 great, maybe your best year yet. If Ryan and I can do anything for you, you know how to reach us, just DM us and say private. We'll get back to you and we will find a time to chat. So until then, I hope you're having a great week. It's Friday for me. I hope you are um, ready to kick off your weekend and I hope you'll find one or two things to do in your bedroom. Have a good night, guys. Bye.